Hey guys, God bless. Welcome back to Twist and Shout. And of course, I'm Char. And <laughs> woo, this is my second hair video since the new year started. So if you're seeing videos prior to this video in 2021, woo child, I've been behind. But anywho, y'all should have seen by now, I dropped a video where I use this as I am with grease. Then I attempt to make it. So I show you guys on camera and I end up putting it in this bottle. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I, t I record myself testing it and I say, you know what? I, I made a mistake because, and even I said it, I probably should have changed the bottle. And I forgot and I tried to use it and film it and it went bad. We know that this is one of those heavy duty squirt bottles. So a lot of it comes out. This, not so much. It's just like a little mist. Like, it's a real faint mist. Which, it's not horrible. Like, maybe in the summer months where you don't need a lot. But in the winter time, I need my drip. So, I broke it in half. And I put it in a different bottle. And I added more water. Because I also noticed with this that it had this real greasy feeling. And it's like, I need to make sure I have enough water in this product. So, I split it in half. And I put some more water to it. And now, for you guys, I'm going to, whatever happens on this video, it is what it is. So, I did change my hairstyle. I will post a picture where I was looking out before, looking like before. And I split my hair and separated it. So, now I'm just going to just refresh my little puffs. And I'm just going to spray like this. And I'm going to rub it in. Spray. Rub it in. And I don't have a mirror. I probably should get one. But just want to, you know, rub it in a little bit. Now, so far, it does not feel exactly like the other product. But it does feel like it's giving me what I need, kind of. And I need to, um, this is the one bad thing I don't do either. I don't spray in the fro. I need to spray in the fro. There you go. There you go. So, so far it feels good. It feels good. Oh, and while we're here, let me show you guys a, tri a trick, right? So you see that when I go to hold it like this, the, the puff looks smaller, but y'all know the length of my hair. My hair just shriveled up real bad. If you just band it one time, like just put it on and then let it drop, it looks bigger. So a little tip for you. Shake up. Just add. Let me take this piece out too, because I kind of just threw this over here. Cause this The design I had first, it was coming in the middle, but it don't matter. I was just doing something different, you know. Trying to be cute for the new year. But anywho. Okay, so I love the texture of this. This is way better than when I was trying it out first. At first, it was just like this real... I don't know, like... like you know, like the feeling of oil and water mixing. Like, you know, when... You're cooking, um, you're cleaning stuff, and you're trying to clean and grease off something, and it's just like, it just ain't happening. And I'm not a fan of that feeling, and I don't like it on my hair either. But now this is better, because I added more water, and you can tell. So I'm still getting what I need. I'm still getting, you know, the vitamin E, the castor oil, but it just feels better. So let me just brush this up. Ooh, I need to invest in a long mirror. Now that I'll be turning my phone the other way. I would say this side got moist quicker. Don't know what's up with that. I'm trying to make sure I got it back the same way. Okay, there you go. There you go. Probably not even, but... And this little piece here. Just twist it back and just kind of you know put it back in here and just put a little bobby pin on it so let me get that right now my hand's slippery 
and voila like that's my hairstyle y'all that's how i'm rocking for the next couple of days you know and again my diy and the storm ball now i would be honest just like when i was testing it i said you know what it's something that i'm just not quite getting um in here that's in here besides i i know smell plays a big part too like this smells good but i would say that if you're just strategically against store-bought especially with all these cancer rumors and stuff floating around i understand and like i said watch the video where i put in here no preservatives no dyes no nothing or if you're just like look whatever the will is of god then that's what it is then you might want to buy this um 16 ounces for six bucks i don't think that's horrible now i would say a little heavy-handed with this because it's like it makes your curl pop and it smells good so i'm already halfway and i only had it for about a month <laughs> so if that is something you take into consideration then by all means but yeah <laughs> i just been but i in my defense i've been using it on my son's hair my daughter's hair and my baby boy's hair and my hair so if you're just a, one person then I don't see why this wouldn't be a good buy for you. Six dollars once a month is not bad, even and that's high range. Like I said, I've been t -t 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 -t. so if I save, I would just you know just spraying it here and there, two months easy. But anyway, tell me what y'all think. I hope it don't look too horrible that I can't see since I turned my phone the other way. So I hope it ain't bad, but it feels good. It feels better. It's not dry. It feels moisturized. So. I'm happy. Comment below. Ugh. Comment below. Don't pollute. Keep it cute. I love you guys. God bless. Take care. Bye.